Yo, what's up guys? PK Sparks here. Welcome back to Super Mario Sunshine. This is the semi-finale. We have one other part after this episode. It's coming to its end, guys. We're almost done with this playthrough. Can you believe it? We started on like June 8th or something like that, and now we're coming to the fruition. We are coming to the apex. The pinnacle of this playthrough is now at its end, and I'm actually sad to see it go. But at the same time, at the same time, while our playthrough is um, ending, that means that no one will, will be beginning soon. That's freaking awesome. Okay, that's not awesome. <laughs> but the fact that a new playthrough will be beginning soon is freaking awesome. So if you guys enjoyed this video, like I said in the last episode, we want to try and increase the likes with every single video. So demolish 750 likes. Is that a possibility? As we backflip and get the first of many shine spikes, we're going to be getting an Al Delfino. Bing! Good job, Mario. Although I gotta turn this audio down a little bit because it's kind of hurting my ears. Continue. So I wanted to knock that one out the way, and um, we'll go back to the uh, to uh, to the airstrip soon enough. But we have a lot of places we gotta do here on our Delfino. So it's gonna come on, freaking. I hate the, like why why does it have to be up behind me so specifically? Just, just look at it. It's like for no reason. It's just like there we go. We're gonna zoom out. No, we're still doing it. Freaking biscuits. I don't know. But in any case. Where, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? You have to be here somewhere. Oh, I heard it. Oh, is that you? Ah, there you are. There you are. How you doing, buddy? That's the second shine spike we're getting in like 10 seconds. <laughs> but I love it, though. We're going to be getting that animation a lot. So I don't know if I'm... No, I'm going to be dancing every single time. We got to get this knocked out the way. Um, What is it? By the way, I'm saying this right now as a full disclaimer. I do not... Um, I do. It was a contrary to what I was saying yesterday about how I want to be more positive about this game. Hey, uh, contrary to what I said yesterday, I do not promise any rage that is. Um, I do not promise that there won't be any rage exhibited in this video due to the sum of the shine sprites that I'm going to have to get. You guys should already know. If you are a fan of this game, if you have played this several times, you already know that, um, was it? You already know that some of these are a Rooney Dooney. Some of these are a Rooney Dooney. And, um, especially one in, one in particular. But you know what? The one in particular also, um, also, what's the word? Influenced today's community question. What is your favorite game show? I, I really want to know this. What is your favorite game show? Because I know, like, in this generation, people don't watch much TV, which means that most people don't watch shows, which means that most people don't watch game shows. Because game shows are really one-off things. And if, pe if people nowadays watch a video, they tend to be video... I'm sorry, if people t nowadays watch a game show, they tend to be game shows... Oh, Biscuit. There we go. And we get the backflip. Backflip! I love it, but uh, what is it? People don't like if they do watch shows. There's something with a narrative, such as um Breaking Bad. People like watching that show. Game of Thrones. People like watching that show. So shows like that uh, that has a narrative. People are all over. But when it comes down to um, let me just get, get this rock and make it easier. But when it comes down to, um, like, game shows, I don't know if there's even a game show out right now that's popular. I'm not counting something like American Ninja Warrior. I don't think that's more of a game show. So much as it is a, um... Are we hitting it? I, I see the little animation, but I don't hear anything. I... It looks like we're hitting it. I'm actually not sure. It looks like we're hitting it. All right. All right. Yeah, we're hitting it. I heard. I hit something. I don't know why I hit. But I hit something. Turn it off. There we go. Thank you. But yeah. Um. So yeah. When, where's Yoshi? There are no game shows nowadays, and it kind of makes me sad because I love game shows. Like they, they were like a big part of my childhood when I was a kid. Like my mom. Uh, my mom and I used to watch the Game Show Network, so I watched all the old game shows she would watch, such as such as um Whammy. Whammy is that jam. What, and what's the one? Um, it's like it was a game show that they had different. All right, but um, 
it had like different years to it, the guessing game was like, I don't know, but it brought on celebrities, it was like six celebrities, and people would have to try and um, make an answer that most of the celebrities got, or something like that, but it was, it was a fun little game show, it was a fun little game show, the, oh, the bat, box smashing game, I like this game, I like this game, but um, it was a fun little game, and I enjoyed it watching that with my mom. I just can't remember the name. I just know it had like 83 and 93 and stuff like that. But it eventually went away because, you know, stuff like that gets old. But, uh, and then also, like, I feel like the most recent game show people have that may know is um, Deal or No Deal. Deal or No Deal was a popular show. But that game show also went downhill quick. You also have game shows like, um, freaking, what do you call it? Uh, Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? That's, that was also a good show, but it was good when Regis Philbin was there. I mean, I did like the female um, lead as well, but she went on to have her own talk show. I forget her name, but I remember that she was cool. Um, I think Terry Crews hosts it now. Terry Crews hosting Do You Want to Be a Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? It's, or Do You Want to Be a Millionaire? That's the, who, who, what is the name of the show? I forget. Um, let me scroll down now, this list. Uh, we are on. Oh no, we gotta do the boxing game the game twice, and then we do the Chuckster on the roof. <laughs> but yeah, I always enjoyed um game shows, so I'm curious. Oh no, hold up, hold up! I can't talk about game shows and not mention my childhood game shows: Nickelodeon, Guts, Who Led to the Hidden Temple, Wild and Crazy Kids. Double Dare, what would you do? Yo, I wanted to be on all those shows. No, 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 no. I wanted to be on all those shows a little bit, but what show I wanted to be on the most was freaking, um, who wants to be a mo not who wants to be a millionaire? Wild and Crazy Kids and Guts. Do you have it? Backflip! But yeah, Nickelodeon Guts, I wanted to be on so bad. And Legend of the Hidden Temple, I wanted to be on, but at the same time, high key, I was terrified of the Temple Guards. <laughs> Yo, by the way, I do know that there's a Legend of the Temple movie coming out, and it looks pretty sick. I, like, I don't know if my, I don't want to have my nostalgia glasses on, but my nostalgia glasses will be on. Like, I'm just gonna fully admit that right now. My nostalgia glasses will be on, so do not disappoint me or you will face the ear of PK Sparks. And that's not the ear that anybody wants to really face. Throw me in the roof! Yeah! Oh, God. <laughs> Camera angle got bodied! <laughs> Yahoo! Good job, Mario. Get ready for the next round. Alright. Um, continue. My fault. I brain farted hard. 100 coins. I already got that one. And now it's time for me to rage. Guys, it's time for us to do the, the pachinko game. Which is why I said that, hey, this game is great. Like, it's a lot of fun. Because, uh, what is it? And the reason why it inspired it. This game right here. It's better in The Price is Right, which is another show I watched a lot. Like, I'm telling you guys, if you guys don't watch The Price is Right, wait, hold up. If you guys don't watch The Price is Right, um, if you're ever, actually no, it's summertime, you can watch it right now. Turn on CBS at, C, at um, 3 p.m. EST. I don't know what time it would be for, um, for like, anybody on the West Coast or Midwest or whatever. But, turn on CBS at 11 p.m. EST and watch The Price is Right. Now, unfortunately, you don't get to watch the good, good glory of it when, you know, we have Bob Barker. Bob Barker is the GOAT. Always get your pet spayed and neutered, neuter, kids. But, um... <laughs> control the pet population. Always get your pet spayed or neutered. I, I don't know why he said that. I wanna, I, I'm gonna look into that. Why did he feel the need to, um, to mention that? Like, you know, I, I understand, like, you know, controlling the population. I get the message. But, like, why? Like, what, wait, what? Generated that? Did he have like? Was his mom like a cat lady? He does. His mom like was one of those people who adopts every single stray cat that they see. Hold up! Hold up! Hold up! I can't believe I'm doing this. I haven't messed up yet. I'm gonna mess up. I'm gonna mess up. There's no way. There's no way. This is tr this is garbage. There's no way this game is not giving me more hassle than this right now. Oh no! Why did I just jump for? <gasps> Oh my god, what? 
No, I'm gonna mess up at the end. I'm messing up at the end. I refuse to believe that this game is going to be this easy for me. Cause I had no issues so far. I refuse. I refuse. No. Alright, so I messed up once. But I, I, again, I refuse to believe that this thing isn't going to be annoying. Nah, 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 there's no way, there's no way, there's no way. Do, 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 do. This is the same reason they have for the sandbird. No freaking way! No freaking way! I was ready to flip tables! I was ready to break windows! I was ready to throw controllers! And nothing happened! What? What? Yo, you know what? Why isn't that a um? Why isn't that a mini game? Yo, I'm gonna tell. I'm gonna talk to Chugga. Or I, 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 I say it like I actually know him personally. But I, I'm a um. I'll tweet at him. Robert, like, yo, no, no, no. Where was it? Voices are suggested are louder in um. People are louder in groups. So you guys should tweet at Chugga and tell him, yo, the Pachinko game in Super Mario Sunshine. You can go to that mini game at any time. All you need is a hover nozzle. Tell them to go to that game and make it a contest for throwing controllers. You get two chances to collect all eight coins on one go. So you get two chances, one swing, um, like five minutes time or something like that. But make that a, like an option. Like that, that would be so much fun because that game is so frustrating. I don't know how I did it on the first time, but hey, it's a thing. But right, the next one, Pachinko Mini. Oh, the gold bird. The gold bird. I said the. G oh God! I just saw the one we need to do after this. I am sad. I am a sad PK right now. Yoshi, I kind of need you. Mm, okay. I, I don't know why I was thinking about that one. Oh man, but yeah, we, we need Yoshi for this one. Uh, for these next two, actually. So let's go ahead and get this out the way. Now, this right here, I want to get off the topic of gaming, sh games, and game shows for a second. So I can talk to you guys about this. Because this one right here. Oh, wait, hold on. Make it this. Instead of my longevity. Oh, I stopped. Uh oh. No, she no! <laughs> Mama, no! <laughs> Yoshi! Well, rip Yoshi. Freaking water. I don't get why he drowns. That's so annoying. That's actually annoying. Whee. I wonder if I could just throw this up there and have Yoshi, you know, eat this. Yo, yo, is yo Mario, is your throw game that high? Let's find out. Oh, shoot! Mario, you kind of the goat. Shut up, police! What in you? You gonna take it? I think I can just make this from. I thought we could, but yeah. Um. So what was I saying? Yeah, this game. I mean, this part right here is so annoying because if like you have to take Yoshi over big bodies of water, actually the biggest body of water. Uh, arguably in the game. Actually, no. Rico Harbor might be a little bigger. Hey, I need you. Come here. There we go. Just doing that for longevity. Gotta jump on the boat. Don't fall off. All right, we are there. Now, all we gotta do is walk to that platform where there's banana. I think it's bananas, or if it's not, it's probably payapa. But um, some sort of fruit is waiting on that platform for us. And then we gotta get that fruit so we she won't drown or dehydrate. And then we gotta jump on that boat that's. You know, going back around, so we gotta wait a little bit longer. And then get all the way over to the area where we gotta spray the gold bird. And then we gotta do, actually, I'm probably making it harder than I am right now. I'll probably, if we get over there this time, then I'm gonna do the mini game first. And then I'll do the gold bird, because if we get the gold bird, we gotta go grab the shine sprite. And then we go to the shine sprite, we gotta leave Yoshi behind us, and I'm gonna have to do it all over again. So if we can get over there the first time, then I will do the mini game first. If not, then. You know, rip. And this mini game, mind you, is also one of the most annoying ones in the game. Because you only get one shot, and you gotta, like, it's one shot on for every coin, you don't have a chance. It's stupid. I hate it. It's, whoever thought it was a good idea needs to be kicked out of Nintendo. I mean, this game is probably old, though. Maybe they're already gone from Nintendo. Alright, can I make this jump? Hey, we made it! Eat the fruit. Eat the fruit. Eat the fruit. Eat, 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 eat the fruit. 
Hey yo, bo, where you at? Can't I make it get over here? I got a Yoshi who is hungry and is thirsty, but we feeding off bananas. You know what? This game kinda makes me go bananas because I am. I what rhymes with bananas? Slammer? Yeah, banana slammer. <laughs> oh, whoops! I drowned my sustenance. Well, oh, that's how that works. Eat it, Yoshi. Look at Mario. He's just like, you do what you gotta do, Yoshi. Uh, -uh I don't care. Boat! Ah! Hey! We did it! <laughs> that was a leap of faith. Literally, leap of faith. Yo, sign me. Or actually, no. Leap of faith isn't a sign. You can't get signed to leap of faith. You more, you more or less get, um, get freaking, what do you call it? Like, it's a team. It's a team. Like a squad, a clan, a team clan. I don't know what to call it. But yeah, game shows, um, they were a big part of my childhood. I freaking loved them. So I want to know what game shows you guys may have watched. And if you have watched any, then um, <clears throat> if you have watched any, <clears throat> god dang, then let me know. I, mean, yeah, I, I just want to know what your favorite game show is. Look at that bird sitting on the water. Hey, y'all bird. You ain't no duck. Get off there. Get off of there. Hey. Oh, I don't want to. I don't want to do that because then I gotta get you. I just, I just gotta reset it. But look, I can't believe we got over here the first time. I guess I've gotten better. I remember being a kid and this thing frustrated me to no end. This whole game frustrated me as a kid. Then again, I'd probably be frustrated right now if I didn't have a freaking guide. So we leave Yoshi back on the island, unfortunately. But for, I think there's fruit in that tree. I hope there's fruit in the tree so he's not drowning. But um, we gotta get all the way down there. You guys can see those this, the skull and crossbones. It's, it's pretty telling. It's pretty much says that you know what you should be expecting here. Oh, not what I wanted. But it pretty much says what you should be expecting when it comes to this level. Where it's just murder and pain. Cause this water, yeah, if you fall on it, you're automatically dead. You see how the leaf is um dead. And if we jump off the leaf, then I believe that it, like, breaks or something like that. So, it's a pretty frustrating level, but hopefully we can, um, do this. So, let's, let's get started. Oh, yeah, once we start the leaf, it actually, um, goes to the floor of the water. Moves to the music, play that funky music. Move it to the music, yeah. Alright, slow down. I'm about to say, don't do this to me. Slow down. Slow down. Oh, can I get that life? No? Alright. Oh my. Come on. Come on, come on. No way. No way. Don't do this to me. No way. No way. This is like the opposite of the Let's Play curse. I'm t no, actually, this is the Let's Play curse. When you when you expect to do terrible, you do well. And then when you think that, I got this. This thing is so easy. You get bodied. I hate Let's Playing. Forget, I don't like it's, it's like it's, the, it's so bad. Ask any Let's Player out there. They will all attest to that fact. When you need to do well, you do terrible, and you look like you're garbage. And then when you expect to do bad, you do phenomenally. Just the second time we did one of the hardest challenges in these science bright get mini games that I just went through on the first try. The first one being the Pachinko game, the second one being that game. And I so I fully expect I don't get it. I don't understand my life. I don't understand my logic. What is what am I living right now? I don't I don't I don't someone help me. Someone help me. G give me a rule book on life. I mean, a guide book on life. Just tell me the guide book on life. Do I, got, do I just gotta spin the dial and if I land on 10, I go 10 times? Do I only, can I only get uh, a salary of over 60,000 if I choose to go to Vital College? Can I, am I only allowed to have four kids in my van? Can I, can I get like an SUV and get like six cars in my van? Or was, or was it, like an eight seater? Is that, a, is that a possibility? Someone give me the guide book to life, please. Cause I don't understand it. Where'd that bird go? I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, it got killed. Be gone. Why are you going all the way over there? Why? Why? All right then. Well, looks like I'm gonna need a hover nozzle since he wants to go platforming. I like how you can move better when you have um 
You can move better when you have freaking what do you call it? Uh, I'm brain farting hard. Wait, why am I using that nozzle? Ow! All right. Why did I say sorry? <laughs> But yeah, you move better in the water when you have the turbo nozzle. There you go. I brain fought it again. Alright. I think it went over here. Where'd it go? Oh, it went over there. Can we make this? And we get the backflip! Alright, not that much more to go. Um, turbo nozzle fun. You get this one after unlocking the turbo nozzle. Oh, okay, sweet. That's actually pretty simple. That's actually really simple. I like the turbo nozzle. The turbo nozzle is funny because you just, you just get to move around fast. And, I mean, who doesn't love speed? Which is why I still want the Sonic games to be good again. That's another game Another game I want to redo is like Sonic Heroes. I never even did Sonic Heroes. What goes up must come down. Where my feet don't touch the ground. See my world spinning upside down. I'm out, out, out of sound. I can feel your every rain. Step aside, I'll set the pace. Break it through your crazy maze Break, break, break my eyes on you Watch me Thumb and life away Watch me Save the day We lie By the end I'm heading your way Sonic Heroes Alright Um Yeah, they had a lot of My God Yeah, we just broke into the police station Water slide in the game Oh, this was fun Okay, this was fun This was fun Really? 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 Okay, that was strange. Whee! Whee! I shouldn't even need to tilt myself. Actually, it looks like I need to. Oh, I didn't jump! No, Mario, no! Told you. Oh, my coins. My coins, no. Coins, why? Come back. Yeah, I told you guys when I need to do um, well because it's something easy, I always fail. And then when it's something hard, it's just like, no, you're not going to fail. Hurry up. We are running out of water. Oh, never mind. This is literally just hold R and um, A. Like, we're grabbing to get this. We're just grabbing a smash. Oh, my. Holy crap. That was, that was close. That was actually close. Um, water slime in the game, the lighthouse. Oh, okay, we gotta do the lighthouse now. The lighthouse. The lighthouse! <clears throat> we are getting the lighthouse. We are doing the lighthouse. Cleaning the lighthouse from the muck that is on there. Call it a muck because it is gunk. I miss my mixtape. My mixtape is fire. The mixtape will always be fire, to be honest. True. Come on, get up there. Come on, get up there. Why is it so complicated to get to? Thank you. Get up there. I turn it off. Simple. All right. But yeah, um, what is it? The reason why I asked this question and why I'm so interested in it is because, like I said, I have a lot of generations watching my content. I have 13 to 18 year olds. I have 18 to 24 year olds. I have 24. I'm sorry, 25 to 34 year olds. I'm in the now the 25 to 34 year old group. Yay for getting older. You know, you know what I've realized too. <clears throat> As you get older, you really do lose touch. I feel like it's just an inevitability, but you really do lose touch, and it makes me sad. Yeah, that's what you better ring. The bell tolls for the. All right, we make it. We love it, brother. We love it. <laughs> I was waiting, I'm like, uh, you! But in the case, that was a lighthouse cleaning the shine gate. Ooh, that's what we're doing. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I did the wrong thing. It said the lighthouse, and I did the bell. Whoops. My bad. I don't I don't know the difference between a bell and a lighthouse, clearly. I'm just glad I remember all these. I actually did a, uh, was it, just a quick run through everything, so I wouldn't, I don't know why I didn't think to do this before, but it's like, 
you guys know the last episode, I was always struggling having to do cuts, but it's like, if I just ran ahead and just made sure I knew the location of everything, then it just makes the recording so much easier, and I can talk to you guys. It actually takes a lot of the stress out of the actual recording. So it's like, I don't know why I didn't do that, but I'm going to make sure I remember stuff like that for the future. That is 93 shine spikes. We've gotten like 14? 14 in this one episode. 14. Jeez. Uh, so now we're doing, we did the lighthouse, uh, now we're cleaning the shine gate, and then we were supposed to do a second bell. Well, no, 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 don't go in there. But yeah, I wasn't going to say, I've actually, um, what is it? I have been working on being more positive lately. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I've, it's just like my M.O., but I am a really judgmental person of myself. I, I see, I see all of my flaws. And they're just like, you know, fix that, fix that ish. And like, I, I don't know. It, it sucks being me. Because like, I want to be somebody great. But I don't know how to get there. And I don't have the funds to pay to learn how to get there. So I got to Google everything. But unfortunately, um, unfortunately, I don't learn well from just Google. Like, yeah, I can Google answers. But unless I find a way to get some on-hand experience or have somebody walk me through it. Um, again actually walk me through it and not just say so this is what you have to do um what is it like it's hard for me to learn like I learn from actually doing things so um what is it like I'm just working on my positivity for everything and just trying to have a better outlook on life I, it, it's like rough but every now and then I just have to remind myself either you know why am I doing what I'm doing is it actually fruitful for me? The tall grass. Oh, I hate this mini game. How do I get to this one again? The rocket. Oh yeah, okay. I don't like this one. I'm not a big fan of this one. Like it's, like it's more so just bland and annoying to deal with. Like I get it, I understand it. I'm like, oh yeah, it's a you no know, decent concept, but execution definitely could have been better. We. I don't think I could make that jump on my own. That's why I just rocket nozzled. Hey Mario, can you make it over there, buddy? Can you make it over there, buddy? But yeah, so like I said, um, that that goes that goes along with what I was saying about uh, in the last episode about why I was feeling, uh, about why I felt bad for you know spewing negativity and what, you know my dislikes about the game. Like, there's no need for me to do that. I just kind of did it because it was an outlet. So I don't know. Positivity is something that I'm trying to heart. Get, Get your behind in it. Get your behind in it. Get your behind in there. Thank you. <laughs> Just trying to harness more. Where you at? Where, where are y'all at? Where, where is everything at? Hi, right, I'm gonna get you first. Nope, wrong one. He just stayed up there. Where'd it go? Oh, he did fly away. Never mind. I'm gonna say, where'd it go? Like, there's no way he ran away. And hey, look, there's somebody else who's on fire. I wonder if I have to help you with your fire problem. The fact that he's running through the um, the grass with his backpack on fire and not um, and not catching this entire place on fire is phenomenal. How are you even on fire? There we go. How are you even on fire? Uh, th look, is it really not gonna let me touch him? But yeah, like there's fire right there, and yet that was not. Can I put it out? I'm gonna put it out. Only you can wear it for fire, kids. Uh, maybe I can't put it out. Am I hitting it? Looks like I'm hitting it. Alright, I guess I can't put it out. Waste some water for no reason. Alright. Where you at? Ah, uh, there's one. This one. This one. Get stomp! Oh! How do, you, how do you hit me? I don't care. Get stomp call. Isn't that, um... There we go. Isn't that a thing from Undertale? Get dunked on. Get dunked on. That's what it is. Alright, there should be another one. Oh! This is a red coin just sitting right up there. I'll take it. I'll take it. But there should be another one on one of these corners. Oh, actually, th there's one on this corner. Here we go. Watermelon. Man, I want to do Donkey Kong 64 again so bad. I told you guys about that before, but to everybody who may be new to the channel, um, was I was doing Donkey Kong 64 a while back, and I got to like episode 30. But unfortunately, when I was doing a game back then, I was doing it off of a cartridge. There we go. I'm gonna say, where the heck are you? That's why I hate this level. You can't tell where it's at. Just gotta swing for the fences. But yeah, um, I was doing it off a cartridge, 
of the same cartridge, my, my very first cartridge of the game. And unfortunately, when I... Um, unfortunately, when I was playing that game, I lost all of my data because it just got corrupted. The disc, there was a cartridge, the stuff loses data after a while, especially after like 16 years or so. Probably like 15 years at the time, but still, I was doing it, and it died, and it made me a sad PK. Backflip! But yeah, it made me a sad PK that I've never finished that LP. Um, and I want to redo it because now not only do, could I run it on my computer to, you know, just emulate it, but they even have it on the Wii U Virtual Console. So I'd most likely just play it off of there. Um, but still, let's see, there's one more we're missing. Back to the airstrip. Oh, yeah, the airstrip. That is the last one we're going to be getting. Sad face. Wow. But yeah, Donkey Kong 64 is just such a. Oh, man, I gotta get more coins. <sighs> Where did I get coins at? Where did I get coins? Actually, I can just go down to any pipe and just go under here. There's like a whole poop ton under here. Do 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 do. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, nine, really? Not ten. Ten. There we go. Yay. But yeah, um, Donkey Kong 64 is another game I want to redo. But I'm trying to plan out the next few um, episodes, uh, next few playthroughs, because I want them to kind of coincide with um, you know upcoming events. Like I already know I'm doing Pokemon uh, um, Sun and Moon, so I'm trying to figure out if I can do like some sort of Pokemon game. Um, and I already I already know that I'm doing newer Super Mario Brothers. I'm sorry, New Super Mario Bros. Wii Summer Sun, although to be quite, quite honest and complete with you guys, um, I am, because I wasn't transparent, I should, I should be saying. But yeah, I, I don't know if that's going to happen, because I, if I do that LP, I want to do a multiplayer, and currently I don't have anybody to do it with. So if I'm ever able and fortunate enough to travel again, then maybe I'll, um, ow. Then maybe I'll, like, okay, remember I did, um, New, remember I did New Super Luigi U? And I got Twitter and Apple to do it because I was traveling with them, so we did it then. If I'm able to travel again, then I will contact whoever I'm around and be like, yo, let's do this LP. It'd be hype. But unfortunately, I can't try. I wanted to. Like, I thought I could. But again, help me pay my taxes, watch the videos, and share them around. <laughs> um, Uncle Sam is a little bit of a, um, you know, kind of mean with these taxes right now. So I have to um, pay that off so I can't afford any trips around right now. Which is why I won't be going to any events either, which, again, sucks, but who knows, I'm, I'm trying, guys. Like, being an adult is hard. Being an adult completely sucks. Give me that. But in any case, um, to go back to what I was saying, though, um, the next LP, I'm trying to um, figure out what's going, what it's going to be, and make sure it coincides with the channel. This is the last one. Backflip! <laughs> that is the last... Backflip of the Let's Play. That is the last backflip of the Let's Play, guys. There, there is nothing more for us to do. That is it. There's only one thing left to do. And that is to tackle Corona Mountain. Get the 10 blue coins there. Turn them in for the rest of the Shine Sprites. And the, yo, wait a minute. Didn't we just get above 80 Shine Sprites? Yo, the layout, it got brighter! Yay! Huzzah, I forgot all about that. <laughs> and we're actually, we're going to be shot, I'm getting this um, pretty bright in a little bit. But, we have saved our Delfino, everything is as bright as it could be. The last thing for us to do is to beat Bowser, Corona Mountain, get the last Shine Sprites. And for the first time ever, I'll be here with a little bit of help. 100% Super Mario Sunshine. Guess I better start planning for the next LP, huh? Better figure that out sooner rather than later. If you guys enjoyed yourself, don't forget to hit the like button for me. Comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, follow my Twitch for live streams, and most importantly, stay hot, guys. I'll see y'all next time.